to be an honor surgeon. I want to be a firefighter. When I grow up, I want to be a climate change reversalist. Even little kids have big ideas about what they want to do when they grow up. As parents, how can we help prepare them for the future? As a parent, one of the most confronting aspects of looking at our kids' uh, future employment opportunities is the fact that many of the jobs that they will be involved in within 10 years, let alone 20 years, have not even been invented. We we'll still need plumbers in 2050, we will still need electricians, but those sorts of jobs will be supported by other types of very technical type jobs that we haven't even thought of. Talk to your children positively about jobs that they've seen in the community or they've seen on TV or on the internet. Encourage your child to see themselves in as many different lights as possible, that they have lots of different things that they can offer the world of work. Get your kids to do something that they're really passionate about. Follow their dreams and hone the skill around that passion. That's going to make you a more creative person. That's going to mean that you're really, you really enjoy your job and you might do something that changes the world. Don't worry if your child wants to be a champion athlete. Many children do. Rather than dismissing it, think about all of the related jobs that they might be able to do pursuing that dream. For instance, physiotherapy, sports management, sports administration, marketing, the list is endless. Courses which are going to be important in the future include ones that are going to support information technology and ones which are going to support communications. Courses which are around international communications such as languages, such as diplomacy, uh, such as psychology, all of those areas I think are going to be in demand as well as courses to do with helping an ageing population. The sort of skills you would be looking for uh, would be people who are open to ideas, that have a global view that are willing to collaborate. Whether you're going to be a scientist or whether you'll be an artist or a doctor, data is going to be a really important part of all jobs. Get your kids to study maths. Study maths at the highest level that they can. Maths is going to be crucial to every job, particularly any job that touches technology. Encourage them to realise that work is full of reward, that it's not just about money, but it's a fantastic opportunity to help society, improve things, discover new things, work with other people, develop your skills. Parents can help their children be more prepared by giving up on the idea that they have to predict exactly where their children are going to end up. I'm extremely passionate about my career. My background is electrical engineering and computer science, but somehow I found myself in a communications role, but working with technology day to day. Most careers have chance and unplanned events which can be positive, the unexpected promotion, the offer of a job or unfortunately sometimes those setbacks due to injury or illness or economic circumstance. If your kids can learn to roll with those punches, to spot the opportunities and take advantage of those, they're going to be far more successful. If your kids are going to be leaving school in the next three to five years, encourage uh, your kids to get as much information as possible. That means talking to careers advisors, going online, looking at different courses at University and TAFE and so forth. But it also means encouraging those children to think about this decision as the first of many, many career change decisions that they'll be making throughout their lives. This is the first step on a really exciting journey. And for more information about helping your child plan a career, go to schoolatoz.com.au.